Hello guys, uh, welcome to my new video. If you are watching this video, it means you are a software developer or software engineer and you are working as a fre freelancing or something like in a company. So I'm expecting this. That's why you are <laughs> watching this video. So in this video, I'm going to cover how to publish your API document uh, through the Postman uh, application, right? So I have uh, this collection right now. And in this collection, uh, in this Postman collection, I have two APIs. I have created two APIs. So, uh, in in case you want to uh, share this uh, collection with uh, your friends or another developer, or how you can do it? Uh, I have seen so many developers that they are doing this do documentation that URL body data and response data of that uh, of, uh, of that particular API uh, was there and they are copy and paste copy and paste and another some uh, more apis you can um, they are creating and they are sharing this by email or by documentation uh, in ppt or something like word documentation so this is old version actually this is an old technique to share the document uh, I, i'm going to show you how to share the entire uh, collection with uh, another uh, person or some other de developers so here it is guys so this is uh, my first api i have created in this api what i have body data and params data authorization is a token bearer token is there and headers data so i want to publish this documentation uh, so for that i have to save this api first of all i have to hit it yeah we are getting this response right uh, with parameters and authorization headers and body data i'm getting this response i have another application uh, another api here so in this api i'm getting the uh, output here in response and this is my api right so i want to publish this let's go don't waste your time let's go and see uh, what i have to do just go to the documentation part in postman api and what you have to do uh, view complete collection documentation click on this button and yeah you can see it okay you can view it right and there is a publish button you can see just press on publish button this is simple as it is so yeah uh, this will open your browser chrome browser or whatever default browser you have and now uh, our postman page will open automatically that will give a, a publish option so this uh, this is the complete thing and i have to go to the bottom just go to the bottom and here it is you can see publish button is there just press on publish and done. it's done dude and we we got a url of, of the published documentation so let's copy it copy it and open a new tab and paste it just paste and let's see what will happen here it is we have our two postmen this is the uh, documentation link you can share with your um, friends and other developers anywhere any workspace right so with your uh, company teammates you can share this documentation uh, uh, this url actually and you are getting this url from here only on click of it a page will open and you can see uh, my uh, test project uh, collection is there and the api documentation i have two api documentation here so i have i have created two api so i got the two api here as well so on click of that i have to uh, i have kept token here so yeah it's showing me token authorization this is my url this is header data what i have uh, kept uh, in in this postman api right so if you see this is the header data abc hana right? and this is the abc header data params i have kept giant so i put it uh, giant in the body body and header and yeah and params in params name giant is there so in params name giant and body data is also there name one giant so in body data name one giant so it is uh, it gave me a highly and efficient documentation on which is generated auto, uh, automatically which is generated automatically by the postman application so uh, here you can see the output as well uh, i didn't save it i think the output i didn't save it 
I have to save the output as well. So save as example, you have to do. And here you can see the output is saved here. So now uh, if you refresh the page, it will reflect here the output also you can see that is response data you can see as well. So here uh, I have clicked here and I have just saved the postman documentation example or uh, I have saved the uh, actually I have saved this uh, response data by clicking on save. Here you can uh, save the response data right save as example. So this data this response data will save and when you uh, open this link again and refresh the page you can see your data is updated here as it is okay this is the body data right what is uh, which is the response data you can see example response this is the response data so this is as it is uh, as simple as it is uh, you can see so that's all guys uh, i have another api created so this uh, this will i don't have anything in this version 2 comment api so it's not showing anything to me but in the uh, first api i have uh, whatever data i have given it's showing me and it's reflecting here in this documentation so this is as simple as it is and you can do it as well and you can share this link with your friends and family and uh, you with your teammates with another developers as well so this is the uh, most powerful publish uh, publishing um, documentation publish documentation easily so guys i think this video can help you a lot if you are a developer so please following this trick to share your uh, postman collection right so in this video we have seen uh, to share postman uh, api documentation is not a big deal it's very easy within a few seconds you can share your postman api collection uh instead of sharing the complete uh, writing the complete uh, one by one url and body data and response data instead of this you can share your uh, document like this only uh, by using postman publish features so this video is uh, enough i think to show you the trick and uh, i hope you, this video can help you a lot thank you guys thank you so much